What is up, everyone? We are about to get started in about 30 seconds. Bear with us. Let's get some people in the chat. And let's kick this thing off. We have so many special surprises lined up for you today. What is up, everyone? Welcome to another Lux Lions AMA. I am excited. I've been waiting all month to kick off this AMA. This is our second live one ever on YouTube. Our third for the year. I'm pumped. We have so many surprises lined up for you today in this show. We have a massive giveaway going on at the end of the broadcast. We are giving away 10 nfts you're gonna have to stick around to find out what nfts we are giving away i'm gonna give you a little hint a little preview and eh, not really a preview but a little sneak peek in a little bit but i will tell you right now this is the largest by volume to date nft project on the xrp ledger we are going to be giving them 10 away to our community members that will go down after this all I am going to say is that you better have a phone, a camera, something ready because we're about to have a little fun. We're about to get some excitement going on, folks. Now, in this AMA, we're going to kick it off. We're going to announce the winners of the March Madness brackets. We got three of them. We're going to go through that. We're going to talk about the Lux Lions Lab. I actually have the lab pulled up for you right now. It is in my second tab. We are going through it. The lab is ready, folks. We're going to show you how it works. We're going to show you how you can create your cub. Remember, the lioness is the key to the lab in this breeding program. This is the first ever NFT breeding program on the XRP Ledger. And it is brought to you by yours truly and the team over here at Lux Lions. You're not going to want to miss that. We're going to go over the rewards overview for the first two months, the new structure is unbelievable. People are loving it. People are getting XRP back each and every single month just for holding these NFTs 30% back. It's absolutely insanity. We're going to talk about Solo 100 and the new utility. We're going to talk about the Pride Tier Series 2 because it's dropping tomorrow, folks. And we're going to give a Metaverse update. We got Jesse, XRP Cop from the community. We are bringing him on live to this episode. He's going to break it all down, what you can expect, where we are going. And we have pictures. For, a fir for the first time ever, you are going to see pictures of the Lux Lions Clubhouse. You are about to be blown away. You're not going to know what hit you. The time you are done viewing all of these beautiful, beautiful images of inside the Lux Lions Clubhouse. Remember, folks, it's 25 plots. It's 250 square feet. This is something that you are going... You're pretty much probably going to have a little FOMO. That's all I got to say. So let's kick this thing off. Let's jump right into this. What do you say? March Madness, three winners, new five bullet, first place. Listen, congratulations, my man. 125 XRP coming your way. You're also getting yourself a Lux Black Exotic Metaverse car for the Lux Lions Oasis. You're going to get yourself a Metaverse Mercenary Profession to be used in the Aftermath Islands ecosystem. A big congrats to you. OG Box, second place, my friend. 75 XRP. You're getting yourself an Orange Metaverse Raft for use in the Oasis. You're getting a bronze super pack for the metaverse to be, be used as well. Check that out. And then Tin Man. I know I've seen you in the chat, big man. Tin Man, congrats, buddy. Third place, 50 XRPs coming your way. A blue metaverse wrap for the Oasis. All those winnings are going to be sent out within the week. I'll have the XRP to you tomorrow. We'll get those uh, spins allocated as well. That's through XMart. 
just bear with us. The spins that come to you, we try to do as much as we can to get Xmark to push it, but they got a lot going on, but we're going to make this happen. Now, rewards overview for the first two months of the new structure. February, we put 335 points into circulation. What does that mean? It means that we gave back to the community over 17,000 XRP. Came out to 52 XRP per point which means 104 XRP were generated just for holding a Generation 2 NFT. Folks, that's silly. Absolutely silly. And what did you have to do? All you had to do was hold. How simple is that? All you had to do was hold. I'm telling you, these Gen 2s are where they are at. Now, don't forget, every Monday, we are dropping the Hunter and Huntresses. Those are worth three points each. We have one hunter, I believe, left. It didn't go this morning. First five went like that. You snapped your finger, bada beam, bada boom, they were gone. We got one hunter left. Absolutely phenomenal. Phenomenal. If you want to go get it, check out the website. You can go pick it up. Now, what just happened? Let's talk about March. 574 points win the circulation. We gave back over 18,368 XRP, which broke down to 32 XRP per point beautiful absolutely beautiful now what so what are the plans moving forward that's the biggest question because a lot of people are used to these these reward systems these reward structures right they're used to seeing the points decline each and every month meaning you get less and less xrp back but don't you worry here at lux lions we have figured out we know a way to change the system to change the system for good we are setting out as a team for the month of April to not see a decrease in points. We are trying our hearts out to keep this at 32 XRP or possibly even higher. We have a plan. We figured out, I don't know, call it a cheat code. Let's see what happens in April. I'm confident. The team's confident. But you're going to have to stick around to figure that out. We can do it. But we got a lot coming in April. We have the lab launching. We have the love potions launching. Remember, male NFT, female NFT, you get yourself a love potion, you're going to breed them. Never seen this before. Auctions, save this date and mark it down. April 22nd. April 22nd. It's a Saturday. We'll be holding our second auction at Burr. I'm excited for that. 75 Pride Tier. Only 75 Pride Tier are coming out this month. It's dropping on the website tomorrow morning, 8 a.m. Eastern. I'm letting it go. I'm putting the page to public. Go at them. Remember, you get one point on the deluxe list for holding the Pride Tier NFTs. This is the second series. All new traits. All new NFTs. A complete look that you have never seen before. Four those, and then Monday Mania. Who could ever forget about Monday Mania? We're coming back. Special Hunter, Special Huntresses in the Royal King and Queen. This would be King 3 and Queen 3. That's all there are in circulation. King and Queen, I think, think you already guessed it. That's how you're going to be able to mint. Stick around for that a lot, folks. There's just so much going on. I'm excited. Now let's talk a little Solo 100. The Solos 100s were meant to stand above all others and to be the pinnacle of any collection. The first utility of this collection was the announcement of the Flying Lions. In-game mounts that would be able to be used in the Lux Lions Oasis Metaverse and Aftermath Islands. The limited collection of Metaverse items will be the envy of any player. Folks, the Flying Lions are super rare. They're super unique. And only Solo 100 holders got them. However, yours truly, right here, I had bigger plans. I always have a bigger plan. Everyone who's been in this project since day one, everyone who's been following me since 2017 when I got into space, I always have bigger plans. I did something that you never seen before in the NFT community. You got that right. What did I do? I gave you, yes, you the holder a voice. I gave you a voice and an opportunity to participate in discussions regarding that collection 
and your utility. And you know what we did? We took everyone's comments, we took everyone's perspectives, we put them together, we sat down as a team, and we, we did a little mix and match. We grabbed a little from here, we took a little from there, took some from over here, we put it together. Your voice has been heard. No other community is doing this. We hear your voice and we implement what you want to see. Each Solo 100 now offers discounts on purchases, not only for NFTs, but for metaverse purchases, folks. Make them on the website. Trust me, it works. I've given back people so many X, so much XRP each and every single day. It's that easy. You buy something, you put it in a little comment box, you tell me you're an OG holder, a solo holder, or whatnot. You got special things coming back to you. You can stack it up. We even let you stack it up to 20% off. The more solos you possess, the greater the discounts you're going to receive. My man Showerm, he knows all about that. He stacked them like I've never seen anyone stack something before. You got an distinct 20% off. You got a rare 7%. You got a unique 4%. You got an uncommon 2%. Just, but just remember, you got to use your discounts wisely because you can only use those discounts once per month. So if you know you're getting a big old order in there, you might want to hold off and stack them up. Pride tier NFTs. Another reminder, tomorrow, folks, 75 coming. One point in the Deluxe list. New trades available on the website at luxlionsnft.com. Now, I shot through all this rather quickly because we are about to jump into the most, or I should say the most, the biggest advancement on the ledger, the first ever NFT breeding system. Folks, we tested, we went through this system up and down, we ripped it apart, we tried to break it, you're not breaking it, you can't do it. We've tried, other team members tried. We went at this thing. And let me tell you something, there is no a better feeling than sitting in the lab and breeding and creating your own NFT, creating and developing your own cub. The own, your own cub that is going to be unique to you. Remember, you need a lioness. There's only 250 lionesses. I think there's about 60 left. I'm going to tell you right now, whoever comes to the lab first and designs their cub, no one else can design a cup to look like it because if someone tries to copy your cup, they go to mint it, it's going to say, no, 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 I don't think so. All these traits have already been used. No duplicates. You're picking what you want it to look like. No more. You're going to come to the site. You're going to go spin a wheel. You're developing your own cup on the website in real time. You can play around with all the traits. There are a crap ton of traits it's addicting i'll tell you you're gonna get lost here we go let's pull this up here it is folks deluxe lions lab this is where it all gets started i'm getting chills just talking about it this is where the magic happens okay you can see it right here login to you some while it's pretty freaking clear right that's what we do we hit login with some you are not seeing the pop-up that's currently generated on my machine, but what is it? It's what, exactly what you're used to. It's asking you to scan a QR code to attach your wallet. That's what it is. I'm going to go up here. I'm going to go ahead, and I'm going to pull up my testing wallet for this. Let me do a little zoom action, put my magical passcode in. I'm going to hit the little black button. I'm going to hit scan QR code. I'm pointing it at the old TV screen. I'm going to slide to accept. I'm going to put my passcode back in. Bada beam, bada boom. This is going to clear. When it clears, let the gates open, folks. Let it open. Here we go. We are entering the lab right now. What's it going to do? It's simple. It's going to read your wallet. On the left-hand side, it will load your mail NFTs. The mail NFTs that you are able to use is going to be a solo, a Lux Lion OG, a public or private uh, Generation 2, and a Primo NFT. On the right-hand side is your female, folks. As you can see, for test purposes, some of these are about the same because it's for testing purposes, but it will load every lioness that you are currently holding. Here at the bottom, you can see the potions. You select the potion. When you are ready, when you are ready to breed, you hit the breed button. Remember, none of your NFTs get burnt here, folks. You're not losing an NFT. You're keeping the NFTs. The only thing that we will burn 
is going to be the potion. We hit breed. It states, are you sure you want to breed? We go in here, we hit yes. We get to the next screen, choose your traits. What do you want to make? Do you want a male? Do you want a female? You tell me. I'm going to go with the male. Look, you got your different categories up top. Background, skin, headgear, clothes, eyes, eyes or accessories, mouth. We start going through these. We go ahead. We could choose a background. I'll scroll through some of them all. We got some plain backgrounds. We got some funky backgrounds. We got some foresty, desert looking ones. What do I like? What does Rip like? How about this one? You see right there in the middle of your screen. You see that? No, no. We don't want that one. How about this guy? You can change them. You can change everything to see how it looks. Let's go to skins. What kind of skin do you want for your cub, folks? Do you see all these? Let's try a purple one. Ah, that doesn't look good, right? You're not penalized. You can choose whatever you want. You can go back. We can change a different background if we want it. It doesn't matter. The only thing that matters here is when you hit that create button. When you hit that create button is when this all goes down. So, as we keep going through, we choose a headgear. You probably noticed some of these. These are all the different headgears that we have used before in the past within our collections. There's a Santa hat. There is a space hat. We can go with the little funky hat. I like that one. How about some clothes? If you want to leave this cub naked, you hit the X, you don't pick clothes. Who cares? How about this? We going scuba? Or we like that fur coat? A little Michael Jackson action? I think the cub's a little too young for a coconut bra, but hey, you never know now, do you? We got the shirt right here. Folks, we have, it's just crazy. We got the body armor. For me, for my sake, I'm going to put a cub in a cub shirt. How does that sound? How does a cub in a cub shirt sound? Eyes, what color eyes do we want to go with? Ooh, those red eyes are looking pretty phenomenal, aren't they? Oh, I think those yellow ones and the blue pop. Folks, you get it. I can sit here for hours. I'm not trying to waste your time. We'll get the little piece glasses going. We go over here. We can choose an accessory. How about a little headgear action? We can pick a different kind of mouth. Little XRP tongue sticking out. Here it is. We hit create. You're going to get this message. Burn request generated. Awaiting some approval right here is when it's going to do the actual burn of the potion once you burn the potion that's it there's no going back there's no remaking this thing what's what it's asking me i got a, an alert in my sum i go to the events i slide to accept i put my passcode in my potion then gets burned once the potion is burned it then goes back and now it gives you another request to mint the actual nft i slide to accept again i put my passcode in that is it the cub is made you can see everyone gets put in the queue queue number 47 and the little upper right we can see the wheel spinning as soon as your nft is done minting and it probably takes i don't know folks 30 seconds it will tell you that it's completed and we know that the cub there you go upper right nft mint successful that's completed we can come to the history tab it even gives you the hash id that you can look up on the xrp ledger this has never been done. This is a first. I am super excited for everyone to get in this lab and to start minting their NFTs. This is going to be huge. This is going to be absolutely huge. This was very, very big on the Ethereum network. It is now for the first time hitting the XRP ledger. And it's going to be something like people have never seen before. I can't freaking wait. Now remember, this is just the first the first line of breeding, male, female, cub. We will have a future, uh, a ton of breeding campaigns in the future that you're going to want to pay attention to. Cubs earn you one to two points on the D locks list. What does that mean? It's simple. More XRP back to you in the long run. Why not? I'm going to give you a little inside tip here. The lioness. That's truly the key to all this. 
If you don't have yourself a lioness, you're not getting yourself a cub. There's only about 60 of those left. And I have a feeling once this lab is live and people start seeing the lab and we start pushing the, the lionesses again, they're not going to last long. And the beautiful thing is that you can use a credit card on the LuxLionsNFT.com website to purchase a lioness. We allow that. How genius is that, folks? Get some credit card reward points, get a lioness, get a cup, start earning XRP back each and every single month. I'm excited. Now, whew, I'm sweating from talking about that. I've been waiting to show that off forever. Now, let's, let's talk a little metaverse. Let's talk about the biggest metaverse that's incorporating the XRP ledger. Let's talk about Lux Lines and what we're doing with Anthemath. Let's talk about, or let's let's give let's give some some sneak peeks, some previews before I bring my buddy Jesse into this conversation. So, folks, for the first time ever, we're doing a lot of first on this show. I've noticed the pattern here: first ever breeding campaign. Now we're going to show you for the first ever pictures of inside of the Lux Lions Clubhouse. Let me show you. Let me show you which one I want to show you first. Let me show you an overview. Let's drop this one over here. Okay. Here's kind of like a little overhead shot of the clubhouse. Okay. 250,000 square feet, 25 plots. You can see the lion head. You can see the lazy liver, river that's floating through the clubhouse itself. You can see the maze that's going through the clubhouse as well. Okay. We get this picture. Here's another shot. Of the actual clubhouse a little side view for you looking at this thing it is absolutely gorgeous gorgeous folks I'm excited for it now as we keep looking I get so many pictures I'm trying to see uh which ones I want to show you here's another another view a couple of palm trees just chilling over there on the side Drop this one in. You can see the nice little, nice little fountain over here. We got some interior pics inside the clubhouse. More inside. This whole thing is being developed and created right now. Look, look at the maze. This maze is going to be phenomenal. I will tell you right now, there are going to be races through this maze. There's going to be hide and go seek going on in this maze. There's going to be a lot of weird stuff going down in that maze, folks. Here's another overview. This is the rooftop. Massive infinity pool on this thing. Massive infinity pool on the rooftop here, folks. We will be releasing a video giving you a fly-through about this. We'll get the video out. You'll have a 4K High resolution video. We'll get some 4K high resolution images on this thing. It it's crazy. I've seen it. I I've been working with JD. JD let me in with, with Rob 2.0, who's the architect behind this thing. Everything that is being built is absolutely phenomenal, and it is one of a kind. One of a kind. You've never seen something with it. Now, I'm gonna bring on my buddy XRP Cop. His name is Jesse. You've seen him in the community. Jesse's going to come on. He's going to talk to you about the metaverse, where we are, where we're going, how you can currently get involved right now instead of just sitting on the sideline. Because when this drops, when we open the doors and the floodgates to the metaverse, you're going to want to be ready. You're not. You're not. You're not going to want to start doing. Your research then and figuring out. You want your game plan now. You want to have the game plan now. Okay. So XRP Cop, he's going to come up right now. I'm going to bring him in. I got him on Zoom with me. You're going to listen. He's going to drop some news for you. And I think you're going to like what you are about to hear. So let me get over here. You not, you Jesse, not? can you hear me, buddy? Hey, what's up, Rip? How are you today? Oh, I'm wonderful. Thank you for taking time out of your busy schedule, my friend, and joining us. I know the community is very excited you are here, and I, I heard you got uh, 
you got a little uh, a little sneak peek or a little insight of how everyone can get involved in, in Aftermath Islands, the Lux Lines Oasis, and what they should be and could be doing right now instead of sitting on their hands and uh, waiting for this thing to launch. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. So for those of you that uh, don't know, uh, my name is XRP Cop. I am the friendly Metaverse Ambassador for Lux Lions. Uh, I'm also Metaverse amb Ambassador for several other XRPL projects. And I'm an ambassador for Aftermath Islands Metaverse. So because I'm involved in all of the Metaverse stuff, I like to try to keep everybody educated, uh, get them onboarded, and make sure everybody's up to speed on the Metaverse. Um, a couple of things that are coming soon within the next couple of weeks, we are going to be beta testing what Aftermath Islands calls the playground. Uh, so there's a few of us that are going to be jumping into the Metaverse, getting it all ready. So when it launches, it's going to be perfect and everybody gets to test it out. Um, before the launch, though, uh, our goal here at Lux Lions and mine as the Metaverse Ambassador is to get everybody onboarded uh, before the launch. Because as soon as it launches, everybody's going to be scrambling to get in this Metaverse, put down their plots of land, check everything out, buy the items, ride the bikes, ride the horses, uh, fly the, the Lux Lions, flying lion that we got. Everybody's going to be so excited about this. Yeah, I can't wait. I know all the hard work that's being put into the back end on this thing, all the testing that's been going on to get this thing perfect. So day one, there are no hiccups. It takes a lot. I know Aftermath has that free game. We could get resources out. Elcod, you want to, you want to touch on that a little bit for everyone? Absolutely. So, uh, Aftermath Islands Metaverse has launched this, uh, free play to earn game called lost kingdom of Tassara. We call it Elcot for short. In this game, once you get onboarded, uh, you're going to be, uh, you have little minions that will collect resources. When they collect enough resources, you can actually mint an NFT for free. That NFT will be used in the metaverse when it launches, and you're going to be using those NFTs that you create uh, for recipes for like, um, say you want to build an axe, or you want to create a pie, or or even build a house. There's going to be all these resources that you're going to need uh, for the infrastructure of Aftermath Islands Metaverse. And right now, by playing Elcot, you can get all those for free. So uh, a ton of us are just stacking NFTs in preparation for the launch of the Metaverse. So we'll have a, a step up from everybody else that just comes and joins in. 100%. Yeah, I've seen Elcot. Elcot's like a lazy clicker, everyone. You don't need you don't need a supercomputer to do it. You can do it right from your phone. Do it right from a PC. PC. It's a one clicker. Um, Aftermath Islands. Now, Jesse, I know they got a new build coming out for the clubhouse. Oh man, I'm excited for this. Okay, so right now, <clears throat> users that want to get onboarded, um, they will need to download an app called uh, Liquid Avatar. Um, and basically, it's it's Web3 technology. So we're getting away from KYC, giving uh, companies all your information. And with Liquid Avatar mobile app, you basically scan in your face, uh, uses facial recognition software or mapping, and uh, proof of humanity, they call it. So one user, and it's age verified, and so when you load into the metaverse, um, they're actually going to be implementing islands that are age-based or uh, player-specific, uh, uh, like realms, you know, like dragons and all sorts of stuff like that. So uh, the first step would be getting the Liquid Avatar mobile app and, and uh, getting onboarded that way. But um, back to your question, uh, right now you can load into the clubhouse and kind of play around with the metaverse. Uh, but we're launching um, here pretty soon with the next couple of weeks is called the playground. So this is going to be a huge, huge map that has um, little tidbits from each of the different aftermath islands and uh, activities. Um, there's going to be like an amusement park on there. There's going to be some stores and uh, Lux Lions. Uh, we're fortunate enough that our clubhouse should be in there. So we'll be able to test out our clubhouse, but there's going to be vehicles you can drive. Um, we're going to be able to run around and talk to people. They got chat GPT um, three, I believe, implemented in there. So it's it's just going to be so exciting. It's going to be a, a huge. It's going to be mayhem. I think mayhem is the right word, folks. That is all right around the corner. That is coming very very soon. Lux lines will. Well, I don't say will. I don't like 
saying things are going to happen because then God forbid something doesn't happen and everyone comes after me. We should have a nice little presence in there. That is what I'm hearing. When it launches, I can't wait. It's going to be absolutely insanity. Now, if anyone in the chat has any questions about Aftermath Islands, about Elkhart, about the clubhouse, the playground, let us know. If you need to get a hold of Jesse, you got some questions for Jesse and you're going to listen to the recording of this. He's always around the Discord. He is super, super helpful. I know, Jesse, you got anything else to say or I'm going to let you go on your merry way, my friend. Hey, Rip, thanks for having me on here. Uh, if anybody wants to reach out to me, they want to start their process to get onboarded uh, in preparation for the metaverse, jump into Lux Lions Discord and just at me or shoot me a DM and then I'll jump right on it and help you get going. It's a, it's a pretty simple process, takes 15 to 20 minutes. And I actually have a YouTube video that describes the whole thing. So you can do it at your leisure, but uh, get ready. It's coming in a couple of weeks. Awesome. Thank you, Jesse. And I'll catch you on the other side, my friend. All right, everyone, there you have it. You heard from Jesse Clubhouse. It's coming. You seen some pictures. You still got a picture that's up over on the screen share over here. I want to get back to that overview. I mean, look at this thing. 250,000 square feet. Folks, now is the time. Get involved. Get to know as much as you can about the metaverse, about what Aftermath Islands, first of all, who they are, what they are doing, their background, where they come from, what we are doing over here at Lux Lines Oasis. When this thing finally gets off the ground and it's up and running, you don't want to just enter the metaverse and look around and be like, what do I do next? You want to have a game plan. You want to have a game plan. You want to have everything ready to go. Ask questions because when this thing does launch, Jesse's not going to have time like he does now to answer your questions. He's going to be getting slammed. I know myself. I know Crypto Baby and JD. We're going to be pinging him for questions as well. And I hope he comes to us and helps us out first. No, I'm just joking. Don't you worry. But listen, in all seriousness, get the knowledge in. Get Play Alcott. Earn resources. Check out Aftermath. Join their AMAs. They always have AMAs. They're always educating. They always have giveaways as well just for showing up to their AMAs. I've been in before. I've been a speaker for them. The knowledge, the group of people, the friends that you are going to make, and everyone is here to help each other. You don't want to miss out on that opportunity. Now, I know I zip through a lot very, very quickly. We usually hold these things for about an hour. We're only about 33 minutes in. I think sometimes I, I talk a little fast, but it's the New York in me. Now, if anyone has any questions, put them in the chat. I got the chat pulled up. I'm watching it. We can answer some questions. I'm going to touch real quick on the Lux Lines Lab one more time. The beautiful thing about the lab is that it is also mobile friendly, which is great. You can pull it up. They built out. We hired a team of developers. I think we've hired them for about three months ago. You can pull up the lab itself on your phone it has its own ui so you can breed right from your freaking phone and you saw how easy it was it's it's just it's click and go that's how simple it is that's coming this month we gave them the, the thumbs up today to get this thing moved over to our website to get it on uh out off the test net for the ledger to move it over to the main net i'm excited the potions are ready the lioness is already in your wallet and you already got your mail nfts we're we're about to kick up, hit the ground, and kick off, and, and get going with this bad boy. I can't wait. Thank you, Extra Peacock, for coming on. Now, I do not see any questions coming through for this time. I'm thinking that I'm just a great educator, as I like to call myself. But no one has any questions because I am that good, folks. And I've heard it before. Don't you worry. But if we don't have any questions, let's talk about this giveaway. I'm excited. As I said, you better have a phone. You better have a camera. You better have something that you're going to be able to send me what I'm asking for. Because the first one to send it through is getting an NFT. We're doing 10 in total. If you could have guessed it by my little my little teaser, my little hint in the beginning, we're talking Z-Punks, folks. That is right, Z-Punks, which took the ledger by storm. We are giving away 10 
Z punks. They're gonna be. It's gonna be random. Listen, I own a bunch of them. I'm just gonna mint what I, I already have in front of my wallet. I'm gonna mint and I'm gonna pass them along to you guys to the community so you can have them. I think the floor price in them are about a hundred XRP a pop, a little bit more. So we're giving away pretty much a hundred XRP times ten. It's a great giveaway. I mean, it's almost what? What is that? Five hundred bucks? If my math is right, if XRP is still fifty cents at this time. So without any questions what we're going to do we are going to move this over into the discord jd any of my mods out there if you can drop a link to our discord i want everyone to head over to the discord we're going to get a live chat going in the discord what you're going to have to do we're going to we're playing the picture game if you don't know what the picture game is you better get ready it's a great game i'm going to tell you I want to get a picture of something. This is just a test. Don't do it. I'm going to tell me, give me a picture of a cup. First person that comes through in the Discord says we have a picture of a cup, wins himself a Z-Punk. It's that simple. Link is up in the chat. I want everyone to head over to migrate themselves to the chat. We are doing 10 Z-Punks. The floor is about 100 XRP each, so we're giving away about 1,000 XRP, which is about 500 bucks. I think that's a great gift. You know, we're very generous over here. We always like giving back to the community. Get to the Discord. I'm going to end the live. We're going to pick it on up in the Discord through a live chat. And we're going to go through 10 items. Get the phone ready. Get the sneakers on. And let's go have some fun. I'll catch everyone in about 30 seconds in the Discord. Click that link.